Now, the question I'm asking myself in the back part of my brain is, who is that there? And the frontal part of my brain is immediately thinking, why? Obviously, that's Arnold Schwarzenegger. Hello everybody and welcome to my live drawing session. I am Scribbling Chimp and I'm going to teach you how to draw. And boy do I have a good one for you today. So, lots of lightning, thunderstorms, we're going to do Terminator. Yeah. Bit of an arbitrary connection, I'm fully aware of that, but I don't know, I don't know what to say really. Just make, make your own YouTube video. Anyway, sorry that, that was really rude rude thing to say um so who's the hero of the terminator films obviously it's john connor um at some point before they rebooted it six million times he was the savior of mankind um i think um and there's been lots of john connors throughout the ages so the question is which one to draw so many of them well eventually i settled on this one here this um very intelligent uh, looking chimpanzee. There you go. Mr. Christian Bale. Look at him there. Looking all, looking all cross and confused. Slightly dark. Yeah. Mr. Bale, you are my subject. Enjoy this, mate. Okay. Right. Cue the music. Let's start drawing. So here we go. I mean, I mean, what a face. Got some real, some real, some real geometry on this one. Um, in the sort of midpoint of the old, uh, the old reboots was uh, Terminator Salvation, Sam Worthington, um, lots of stuff happening in that one, yeah that kind of, um, that thing there, sort of, sort of sequel to Terminator 3, Rise of the Machines, because he had that he had that same girlfriend, so they... Yeah, I remember there was a semblance of continuity in the Terminator films back in the day. Um, and it was relatively short-lived. Suffered a... Suffered a real, um... Real chronic case of reboot-itis. Did, um... Did the films. And, uh... Yeah, I think the, uh... The less, the less touched on that, the better. But of course, Christian Bale, fantastic job. Excellent John Connor, of course. Um, very mysterious, enigmatic actor. Um, as you can see, fabulous hair, great hair. Um, keep it on, keep it on focus. Okay, so I'm going right in the face here, so you can see what I'm doing okay um, I mean a lot of people when they do a drawing when they do character profiles they get really kind of um, uh, what's the phrase they get they get really hung up on um, on the position in the features whereas I think it doesn't really matter where you put the eyes or the nose or the mouth you know I mean once you um, once you get those bits in you know and then you put your pen down and it's all finished you know it, it really kind of everything kind of snaps together so if you do do the eyes too low down the face or if you do do the mouth too high up which I don't think I did here to be fair not blowing my own trumpet then it doesn't matter okay 
And that's one of the really important things about drawing is at the end of the day, doesn't matter what it looks like as long as you've drawn it. I'm just going to narrow those eyes a little bit. Um, and then he's sort of looking kind of away from you, but at you at the same time. It's like um, inside each eyeball, there's another eyeball facing the opposite direction. And um, I think, ladies and gentlemen, that really does um, that really does go to show how good Christian Bale's acting is, is that he's able to pull that off with his eyes. And it's something I think is really important to capture when you're doing a drawing, Mr. Christian. You gotta do a bit of stubble there. And as you can see today, guys, I'm not messing around. I'm cutting straight to it, okay? It's Terminator. Terminator films, they get straight to the point. They don't dilly-dally, okay? You know? Um, you know, they skirt the kind of major plot points. Um, and if they um, don't like what they did of a film, they scrumple it up and start again. But I'm not going to do that today. A, because I don't quit like that and B because I just think this is an excellent drawing as I'm sure you'll agree okay yeah do some a few lines on the forehead and um, there you go don't don't get to shave much in the in the future okay and that's it Christian Bale I'm putting my pen down All right. Okay. This is what there was. And this is what there is. Oops, sorry. Let me try that again. There we go. Bingo. Right, okay. Now, I never just do one drawing, okay? Um, I always throw something in the mix just to um, flesh out these stupid videos. No, uh, just to flesh out the um, the kind of the, the charisma, you know, of the drawing, the kind of uh, the scene, the world that they occupy. All right, I'll just give them a body. Uh, don't worry too much about bodies. Um, I'm only going to draw it up to there. Kind of like he's <laughs> peeping over a wall, and you'll find out in a second. Right, this is good. I've been fan of, I've been a fan of the Terminator films for a very long time. Now this drawing takes me back to November. Nope, October of 2019. It takes me back all the way to October of 2019. And the reason why it does that is because October of 2019 is when another Terminator film came out, and that Terminator film was called Terminator Dark Fate. Okay, so when I watched it, I got all terminated up. And I knew one day that I'd do this. I knew one day I would do this drawing of Christian Bale. I thought one day, maybe next, you know, summertime, spring, whatever, I'll do this drawing. So as soon as I got home from the cinema that day, I did some lovely scenery for this film. Okay. Um, which I'm going to add Christian Bale to in just a second. Now, I appreciate that you might be a bit confused. You're thinking, what the hell is this guy? You know, as if this whole spectacle isn't bad enough, he's now. No, listen, I'll explain to you, okay? I'm just gonna dig out the box, okay? October 2019, I did a draw and I put it in a box. I'm just gonna grab that box now. Just give me one second, right? One second. go all right okay sorry i had to i had to dig real deep for that okay i found it here we go just um just brushing all the dust off it there okay so this is what i drew lovely terminator pick yeah okay this is my lovely terminator picture um as you can see i wrote back in october i wrote do not open until 2020 okay so here we go just gonna look inside See what we got, and oh, I can't wait to see. I, I can't actually remember what I drew, you know. Um, can't remember for some reason it's kind of disappeared from my head, but that's okay. It's gonna 
Okay, I'm a little bit confused. All right, I don't quite understand what's happened here. Now, the question I'm asking myself in the back part of my brain is, who is that there? And the frontal part of my brain is immediately thinking, why? Obviously, that's Arnold Schwarzenegger, who was not in Terminator Salvation. Okay? And look, it's also got a John Connor, but it's the John Connor played by Jason Clark. All right? That's weird. And on this side, I've got I got Matt Smith. Matt Smith. Uh, I know what I've done. I did the wrong Terminator. This isn't Terminator Salvation. This is Terminator Genesis. Uh, this is embarrassing. I did the wrong one. Did the wrong Terminator. Not sure what to do. This is a bit of a hiccup. Okay, folks, well, drastic calls, dr uh, bl <laughs> drastic calls, call, drastic times, call for drastic measures. I'm not going to edit that out, okay? I'm not going to. It's fine. You don't, don't worry about speaking properly. It's fine, okay? I know how to resolve this, all right? Okay, first thing I'm going to do, okay, I'm just going to put it back in this box, okay? Now... Just going to put it back there. Okay, did you guys know... Okay, time travel is sort of possible. And I discovered the secret to it. Okay, all right. Okay, you can't really time travel, but what you can do is you can make a time travel phone call. You can make a phone call into the past, okay? Now what you need, yeah, it's an old phone. I'm going to do this quick, okay? What you need is an old phone, yeah. You need to do then is to hang on, let me some real real kick ass camera skills in effect. Okay, what you need to do is just plug the old phone, yeah, into your computer. Should be a little USB gubbins there. There you go. Okay, now you activate Activate your computer. Okay, right. Never actually attempted this before. I just saw it on, um, just, you know, one of those weird kind of internet sites. Um, but I'm under good authority, it works. So what I'm doing, while my phone's plugged in, okay, next thing you do is you open up the calendar and you go back to your date. Okay, now, I want to go back to October 23rd, 2019, because that's when I did the drawing. Google it. It's when the film came out. That's why I'm saying Google it. October, October 23rd. Okay, so I punched that date in. Okay, right. Now I've done that. Okay, like I said, I'm going to do this quick. All right, now I've done that. Okay, it's gone into the phone. It's just the brightness is really dark, though. That's why it looks like it's not on. Okay, recipe for time travel. Okay, need to get yourself a cup. Need to get yourself a bit of water and lemon. Add the water and lemon. Okay, I'm not going to spill it everywhere. That'd be silly. Okay, um, next thing you need. A bit of curry powder. Doesn't matter if it's old. Um... Mix spice, yeah, just to zest it up even more. This, this absolutely works, this is absolutely true, okay? Okay, um, bit of, uh, bit of jam, a bit of jam in there. Jam, good. Um, and this is a secret ingredient, okay? This is ingredient X. If you like. Ingredient X. And the ingredient X question is a bit of a bit of cat food. Yeah, let's put that in there. It's absolutely true. This really works. Okay, and just a bit of ketchup. Okay, 
and there's your recipe for a time travel phone call, okay? Alright, stick the cable in, plop, bang, Bob's your uncle. Let's do this. Okay, it's ringing. Just uh, give it a second. I usually take uh, usually take quite a long time to answer. Quite a long time. Oh, hi, Ash. Yeah, it's Ash from 2020. Yeah, how are you, mate? <laughs> I bet. Um, listen, you um, you just seen Terminator Dark Fate, right? Yeah. Okay. Well, you did the drawing wrong. Uh, sorry, you're about to do the wrong drawing. You, you're thinking of the wrong Terminator. You, you're thinking salvation. You're going in with good salvation intentions. Um, but instead, you do the Genesis one with um, Jason Clark, and they reboot it. And there's that weird T1000, and they kind of they don't do any more films. So it makes... Yeah, that's the one. That's it, mate. That's it. Um, so basically, I need you to do another drawing. Um, I just couldn't be bothered doing different paper. Um yeah, exactly like rebooting the film. Yes. Well, shut up. Can you can you do it? Can you can you do this, mate? Because we're kind of stretched for time here. That's great. Thanks. So, what you want me to just wait around? Oh yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got you. I got you. Well, thank you very much, mate. I very much appreciate that. Um, yeah, that's that's very very kind of you. I guess I can sort of um, count on you sometimes. Uh, really good, really good. Uh, it's August. Really hot, actually. Um, I haven't actually seen the new James Bond film or Black Widow. No. Um, twenty twenty. Uh, okay, bye. <sighs> Conclusive proof, ladies and gentlemen, that time travel is just too dangerous. Okay, so did he do what I asked? Is it rebooted? I got the right drawing? Ah, look at that. That's much better. See, you got Sam Worthington there. You got your endoskeleton. I don't know why I decided to draw a little bowler hat, but, you know, I like it. Um, and some tattered buildings in the background and look the sun's out because that film was set in the daytime even though it was the future that's brilliant okay so i'm quickly going to cut christian bale out and i'm going to add him to the drawing and then we can get back on with our lives well ladies and gentlemen that sure was fun great fun in fact um i'm a little concerned that i kind of meddled with history and all that i'm not exactly sure um what the consequences of creating multiple timelines is didn't really research that part but i'm sure it's fine there you go john connor in terminator salvation at no expense whatsoever well thank you for joining me guys it's been an absolute pleasure um and yeah learn how to draw it's fun and i will see you next time tara